Good afternoon, I am Lutra FM back again with with some So Show Rise of the Lions youth only goodness. This is episode twelve, I think. Episode eleven was yesterday and we I think we drew I think we won one game, drew two games and lost one game. We lost the last game of the episode to a very strong Strasbourg team, which I was expecting. So if anything, I was expecting us to lose to Bastia and Bordeaux and we drew. So it was a uh, it wasn't too bad of an episode really, but yeah, we've got some two easy games I think. Well, not easy, but like two games I think we can win, and then we've got Leon and Paris FC for the last game of the episode for this episode. So get comfy and enjoy the ride, and I'll be back with the in a sec with the first part of the episode. First game of the episode, we've got we're playing Quevely Rouen. I assume they're the other Rouen team, other than FC Rouen. Anyway, so yeah, we've got a usual lineup by the looks of it. Tete's in midfield, though. Dosu's on the right. But other than that, it's basically the same. It'll let me do it. Come on. What's going on here? God, that took forever. Sorry about that. Right. Hopefully, we can win this game. We do need to win this game to keep ourselves in the playoff places. We'll see. This highlight goes to URM, though. Not ideal. Right, headed out. They're still in possession. They're passing it around very nicely here. Luckily, it doesn't lead to anything. Right, come on. Let's get into this game. Very boring game by the looks of it so far. Oh, God. They've got another corner. Headed out nicely by... They've still got possession now. They pass it. Oh, that was a good goal. It was a bit of a weird shot. I thought that was going wide by the looks of it. Right, I'm giving the, I'm giving the players a, a telling off. Hopefully that'll fire them up to do something now and come back into this game. Trophy usually does better than that with his headers. We retain possession from their goal kick. He then gives it to Qatar. Nice bit of passing on going on here. Oh, beautiful transit passing transitions here. Lovely goal by Tete to finish it off. That was a good team goal there. One we're back in the game. And we now come on. Can we now go on to win this game? Next highlight is going to. URM by the looks of it. Then again, we might be able to get the ball off them. We're struggling to get the ball off them. Oh, for God's sake, our goalie should have done better than that. Just going to hope all these little team talk things will fire them up a bit and make them perform better. Never usually works. All right, see if the second half the players look fired up, so that's good. I feel like we've got better quality than them, but they just seem to be playing better in this game. I've done every single team talk you can possibly think about in this game, and it's not working. They're going to score it, though. For God's sake. We should have won this game. Come on, let's get back in this game. Oh, it's too late. They get the next goal. Obviously, it's game over. Oh, beautiful ball. Offside. That's a shame. Let's try the fire up shout when I get a chance. Throw in. Costa gets fouled. Oh, this might help us. Red card. All right, let's go. Very attacking. Let's exploit them here. Hopefully, we can get a goal in the next couple of minutes. Maybe have a chance of getting a draw, but by the looks of it, URM have shut shop and we can't get through their defence. This is annoying. We should have beat these. One of those teams that we should be beating. That's disappointing. It is disappointing. Maybe a team meeting will help Wait for this process. Yeah, we've got a JCO net to a first. Oh, God, that was a team I thought we'd beat. We're now playing top of the league. Right, let's just do a quick team meeting. There's dynamics. There they are. Courage. Okay. Right, back in the set. So here we are. Top of the, playing top of the league at JCO now. I think we're pretty much, we've got Viltard back in the team, which is good. We've missed him. So, and then we've got Dosu on the right instead of Uzbek. Annoyingly, got in the mood because of the fact that basically, I've just swapped it. I've just put Wise back in the team. Wise back got annoyed basically because we didn't strengthen up front because obviously we're doing a youth only save, so we're not going to be strengthening up front. So he has to be put on the transfer list. So I, I offered him out and nobody wants him, but then that's mostly because the transfer window is closed at the moment. Hopefully he'll drop it and want to stay at the club. Especially if we get a few wins and get higher up the league, he might just go, oh, we're strong. the team's strong enough, the squad's strong enough, I don't need to complain. I don't know why it's all of a sudden taking forever to the start of the game. I don't know I don't know what to expect in this game. We've had two shots though, two on target as well, which is good. First highlight, of course, goes to... Yeah. Oh, maybe not. Built hard. Look at this. Look at this beautiful bit of passing going on here. Ah, oh, Weisbeck lost the ball though. Maybe I shouldn't have played Weisbeck. Time will tell. See how we get on. Galvez and Diagne playing well. Kofi to a point. I'll just keep encouraging the players. Hopefully that will help. Five shots out of six on target. We should have scored at least one goal. It's going to be a goal. Maybe not. Bastian. No. Oh, that's a shame. You watch the level of these score. For oh, okay. That's all right. I was thinking they're never going to score from this. They still might with Fontaine. He, he's, he's a bit nervous with that ball. Don't lose it. Come on. Let's make something out of this. Beautiful pass. Go on, Fatah. Oh, no. Forward, not sideways. Come on. Galvez, a little pass. Get in. 
Nice to see Wise back with the assist as well, which is good. Well, we're winning against top of the league. Well, they were top of the league at the start of the game. We're not top of the league now. Then this first half, please. It would be typical FM if they get an equaliser when you look at there. They've had one shot, none on target. We've had nine shots, seven on target with XG of 1.99. It probably will end 1-1 in this game, though, in my look. At the corner, headed out, back to the piece to nothing. That's good, though. 1-0 up. Their goal kick, though. Will this be their highlight around? Looks like it's going to be... Oh, no, maybe not. Kofi, what a ball. That's what I'm talking about. Qatar with his second of the game. How many goals he got to the season? I don't think he's got many. Yeah, he's only got two goals of the season. Scored his first two goals of the season, though. That's good. Hopefully, he'll go on and score a few more now. We are now seventh. If we win this game, let's take our Viltard if he's a bit knackered. Oh, Drame's knackered as well. Young, you, any players from the U team playing yet is because... Because we're in a division higher now, we start in the Coupe de France a bit later. But they will get some game time in that cup competition. Hopefully we can progress a bit so they can get a bit more game time. I wish there was a French version of the League Cup as then the young players can get even more game time then. I'm, I'm surprised they don't do that in France. Right, Galvez, get in. There you go. Beck repaying my faith in having him in the first team. With one assist and one goal, doing well. Hopefully he is knackered, so we better take him off. We'll put on Rubino. Tired. Oh, we can't take more players off now. That's fine. Let's just hopefully see out this game now. If I mean, they still only have one shot the whole game, but it still wouldn't surprise me if he's in 2-2. The way for FM is designed. Good. In there. No, that wasn't. That was not. Oh, what a name. Flammeron. Right, let's try and close this game out now. Look at that. It would be typical FM. So if they end up winning, drawing with us. This will go from our highlight to theirs now. I don't know you watch their score. Better do focus. There we go. Oh, I forgot we're winning 3-1, not 2-1. For some reason, I thought we were winning 2-1. Ignore me. I was panicking over nothing. We end up getting three goals, though. 3.00 3 XG, three goals exactly. We've just, like, we've just absolutely destroyed them this game. They shouldn't have got that goal, by the way. But I'm a bit annoyed about that. I wanted to keep the clean sheet. Never happy. I'm like Guardiola. Let's see. That's just ridiculous. Tone Mambo, what a name. They've got some beautiful names in this AJCO team. Let's not mess this up now. Can I take him off? No, typical. All right, we're down to 10 men. One minute to go. Come on, let's just end this game now, please. Come on, come on blow the whistle. I was going to say, how much have you told you? Jesus Christ, that was a stressful game near the end. 3 2, even though we should have won 3 0. But a win to win. And now we've got bloody. Let's just raise him. Right there, back in a sec. Leon now, probably the toughest team we're going to be playing in this league. So, uh, yeah, we've got. Pop up in goal. We've got the Costa's right back and Boris is in defence because Fontaine's injured for a few weeks. I think Dossu's on the right, Weisbeck's on the left, and then Patar and Kofi up front. So we'll just have to hope for the best here. Just have to see how it goes. Hopefully we can get a point out of this at least. I mean, we beat technically top of the league last game, so anything's possible. And Leon are actually below us in the league, only by three points, but they're not. I thought they'd be like storming the league, but they're not. So they're really on the downslide at the moment, but they, they could probably get, they'll probably end up going back up anyway. They're too big of a club. Saying that though, sent Entine and Bordeaux, you would just never expect them to, to be relegated from League One, but they were. And they didn't get promoted straight away. I don't, I don't think they've got, oh, there you go, we're giving them a penalty. I think that was inside the box as well. They've got, look at who they've got in the Leon team shirt they got Cherky or whatever his name is oh no penalty that was lucky Cherky Cherky I don't know how you pronounce his name but yeah Hornet they've got some really top quality players that should not be playing in this division right who's injured already we've got we've got Silver on who's a left back for our right back to Costa do we even have a right back no we don't that's one I don't think I don't fancy my chances in, I don't fancy our chances in this game so I will happily take a nil mil draw playing out from the Goalkeeper kick here. Ram Lovely ball. Oh, look at that. That was a beautiful ball. Cleared by them. And now they've got Cornet, who's just a speed demon. They've literally got the same team they had last season. I don't think they've, I don't think they've had to sell anybody by looks of it. Akaret. And then they've got Search. Search? I don't know. I'd pronounce it because it's got the ch sound. So, as I said, I, I say things how they're spelled. So, it's not necessarily right. Still nil-nil. They should have scored at least a goal. And they probably will now. I think that was a save by our goalkeeper there. I feel like the longer they go without scoring, the more chance we've got of scoring because the pressure, I think the pressure will get to them. They've just missed the game. So, at 1.58 XG, they should have scored at least a goal. I've only got Matt Pagotti play for Leo. Silver, who is not a right back, but he's playing there because we haven't got any right backs at the moment. Bon Kofi, Drame, sends it to Daphne. No, no, that was a bit too ambitious, Daphne. There's a reason why you're a central defender and not a midfielder. Oh, well, they've scored. It took them 35 minutes, but they finally scored. Here we go. The floodgates are open now. Well, what a surprise. Here we go. Hey, hey, hey. It's a game of how many goals can we concede now? Right. I guess we're just playing very defensive for the next 40 plus minutes. And they're going to get another one before half time. They do. 
Right, that first half could bugger off. We're going to come out second half firing, even though I've gone all. I'm just going to go very attacking. I'll put the midfielders a bit more forward. Who's playing absolutely terrible? Back, I haven't got anybody to. Oh no, I don't. We haven't got nobody to put on for you, so you're going to have to stay on the pitch. I will give you a telling off though. Kofi is underperforming the last couple of games, which is not good. you will have to come off. He's not playing well at all. I guess I'll have to put the Zard in there. Popov's not playing very well either. Silva, who came on in the first half, needs to come off. He's knackered, but we can't play him. We can't take anybody off. We can't swap him for anybody because we've used all our subs. we just got to hope that we don't concede another goal here. Good save for the goalie. Churchki. If we don't concede, at least this second half was a lot better than the first. But we've still got plenty of this game to go yet. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, I mean, I, I, yeah. Prove me wrong, didn't you, Patar? Right, the comeback's on, everyone. We're going to draw this game 3-3. You watch. Oh. You never know. I think you scored that there and we might have had a chance. Now, typically now you start, you know, to get your thumb out your bum and start trying to win the game. Where were you in the first half, lads? You know what I mean? Not a busman's holiday, mate. Get your thumb out your arse. Well, there we go. We're giving them a penalty. That's a shame. Oh, no, VA. It doesn't really matter, does it? Let's be honest. Whether they get this penalty or not, they still won. You need to do a big song and dance. No. None of the fans are watching you anyway. There's no fans here. Yeah. Come on then, pop off. Let's see what your penalty saving skills are like. Oh, flip it out. Give us a chance. Bloody hell, that was quick. Right, 4-1. Let's end this miserable game. Very disappointing. We're just slowly sliding down the league now. So I don't know if that's, was, if that's meant to happen because we were only meant to be a mid-table team. I don't know. Oh, blue air. We'd love to see it. Right, let's have a look. Okay. Oh, God, I've got Paris FC next. Okay, I'll be back in a second. Now playing... Paris FC. We really could do with a win in this game. Get us back on track. Drame is injured for a few weeks. So we've got Tete in the midfield partnership. Boris is still in the team because Fontaine is injured. And I think that's pretty much it really. Same team. Dosu on the right though. Obviously he doesn't trust the assistant manager. Doesn't trust Weisbeck annoyingly. Even though Weisbeck played well the game before last. Yeah, Paris FC. Another tough team for us to play. There's no easy games in this league. Oh my God, we've got an injury already. Dosu's injury already. Oh, oh. Right. 16 minutes gone, no action so far. Not the most exciting game. I've been saying that for the last this episode and last episode. There have been some very boring games in this one. You can tell it's that there's a difference. In, so last season we were scoring goals for fun and then this one, not so much. But we will get there eventually. The ball, go on. Oh, chip, I think he tried to chip the goalkeeper. Right, throw into Paris FC. Defensive play by us there. Still nil-nil. Coming towards the end of the first half. All right, we need a better performance in the second half if we're going to win this game. So let's try to demand a bit more. Let's step up the performance. Paris FC should have scored at least one and one goal, nearly two goals. We we're, we're not doing so well here. Strikers are really letting us down in this game. I think. Saying that though, they're playing well by the looks of it. Six point seven, six point eight. So maybe it's the service to get in. Bazaar's not playing particularly very well. So we'll take him off. We can't actually take him off. Nobody's replacing with. All right, focus. Let's try focus. See if that'll do anything. Let me know in the comments section what's what what have you found to be the best shout to do? The most effective shout. Is it encourage? Is it berate? Is it fire up? Let me know in the comments section with the, with the cross there. Can we turn something? Oh no, we can't. Go on, go for it. Get in. By the way, that is Baxter chewing on my jawstrings again. It's his favourite thing to do. That and zips. The sofa I'm sitting on, he he has ripped. The lining where the zip is, all the stuffing keeps coming out, but it doesn't matter because I'm moving out soon. This is an old sofa I've, been, I've had for years. I'll be, it'll be chucked anyway, but yeah, he doesn't. So he's got all the toys in the world. He's got, you know, things like that to keep him occupied. And yet he just prefers either to chew me and my girlfriend or things that we like, things that we own, like our socks and our slippers and the sofas that we sit on. I don't understand. I think dogs just like to destroy things their owners have there must be some psychology involved in that if, if you're an animal psychologist please let me know in the comment section i would appreciate it good interception there by bastion can we extend our lead oh i don't know what happened there with 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 that then it froze for about a second but yeah still one nil oh come on Embele's there he used to play for a psg youth team that was just stupid that was such a stupid pass there by our defenders i don't know what the hell happened there it's gonna stand in it yeah yeah God's sake. So close and getting a win then. Right. Have we got another chance here? Can we turn this game around? Oh, we haven't got time to be time wasting. No, it doesn't lead to anything. Got another corner there. Oh, no. Right. Have we got any more highlights? Hopefully in our favour. No, by the looks of it, it's going to end 1-1. Lost opportunity there. Oh, well. Not the best way to end the episode, but here's what it is. Dossie's out for four, three to four weeks. Probably perfect time to save it before I forget. Right then. Thank you, everyone. 
as always, let me just extend this. Bear with us. Club vision before we go. I think the club vision is basically, yeah, it's just to avoid relegation. So as long as we just avoid relegation, even if it's not the best of seasons, at least we've hit our objective. So on that note, I'm going to leave you to it and I'll be back tomorrow with another episode. So yeah, so basically, just before I go, just let you know, Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Fridays and Saturdays are going to be the FM24 Social Rise of the Lions you phone me save content and then Thursdays and Sundays will be TW 2020 Fight Club Pro content for anybody who's watching my other stuff as well. So yeah, anyway, on that note, I'll see you later. Bye.